welcome back or hello if you are new welcome to my channel i have another unboxing for you guys today um i think i'm finally towards the end of the massive pile of pr packages i had sent uh, while i was away and trying to catch up so i think this is one of the last ones um knowing me i'll probably start tidying up and find a couple more so anyway we're down towards the end which is good because we've had a lot to get through um so this looks like a decent sized package i'm not sure what is in here and i'm not sure what company it's from so i'm going to unopen i'm going to open the package not unopen it i'm going to open this package up see what products we've got in there and then i will dip out to check on my gems flow app uh, because i keep a record of everything the companies are telling me they're sending me um, if it's not a surprise and we will go from there so again this is one of the ones that arrived and has been waiting to be open. Oh, okay. A few different things in here. So this box is a little bit bashed, but I'm guessing that's from the shipping. We got lots of stuff in here, guys. Wow. So we've got one, Two possible canvases, two lights, and then two other projects which are here. So we've got six things in total. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, we've got six things in total. I think this is my package from FG Normal. But I'm just going to go and quickly check and I'll be back with you in a second. I'm back. So yes, this is my package from FG Normal. Now this is my second collaboration with this company. I really, really loved the package they sent me last time. It was an amazing package with some beautiful canvases in. Um, and I think that's the one that I got the wreath in as well, which I've actually done now. It is up on my, I think it's up on my Instagram. And I just loved this company. I thought they were fantastic, amazing low prices, a great range of products. And then they contacted me again and asked me if I'd do some more. So here we go. As you can see, I've got, I wanted to go for a range of products because I wanted to sort of show off what they can do. I do have a couple of canvases and then I have four different sort of diamond painting products to do, to show you. Um, again, these are things that are a little bit different. A couple of things I've not seen anywhere else um, at the point where I decided on this. So let's get into this one. It's called the Flamingo Light. Now, as you can see, this package, this box was open. I think that's from it being squashed in transit. I don't think that's um, from the company itself because, you know, last time they sent and everything else looks in perfect condition. I think it's just from the shipping. So I'm going to get this out and hope it's not damaged. Oh my God, <laughs> this is so cute. So I'm going to put the screenshot up first so you can see what this actually looks like. It is a sort of 3D lamp and it's a sort of plastic figure of a flamingo and you just diamond paint all over it basically. Just cover it up. It's actually bigger than I thought it was going to be. Um, as you can see, it's a good size. It's actually really, really cute. And these diamonds are quite different, so I'm very, very interested to have a look at this. Now let's get everything out. So first off, boring bit over, we get basic toolkit. This is the Flamingo. It's made of plastic. It's in very good condition. It's hard plastic. It can't be sort of squished. Underneath is where you would put your batteries. Um, you do need a screwdriver to undo it, and I don't have a screwdriver on me. Um, I'm not sure what batteries it needs. It says 3LR44 batteries, which I'm not sure. What batteries they are so i'll have to do some digging as to what batteries i will need and then it's got the on off switch here so it is a light it lights up so you cover it in the diamonds and then it lights up and it just sits there and i thought that is really sweet my daughter will love this when it's done um it's this beautiful bright pink color and it's actually got the facial details on we've got the eyes and the beak so yeah there's no markings about where you put these diamonds you just sort of like DIY it basically and do it yourself. We actually get three different colours. So we do get a black and a white, 
so we get 310 and possibly 5200 to do the eyes and the beak which i didn't think we would do so that's a nice little bonus but these are just amazing these are i'm trying to explain what these are these are round drills they look a little bit bigger than our standard round drills. I'll try and compare these so you can see the difference in them. They look a little bit bigger than our normal ones. Not much, just a little bit bigger. And they are pink, but they are almost sort of like a translucent pink, which obviously is needed because it's going to light up. I just think they're absolutely good. And they've got the AB, the iridescent coating on, which is just absolutely gorgeous it's a nice big bag of them this is going to be really interesting to see so yeah they are like an, a translucent pink if you can see so obviously once they're on here um, and you switch the light on the light will show through rather than being a solid um, material where the light wouldn't be able to reach through apart from in between them so really clever idea I absolutely love this this is amazing these are just i wish i could i wish you could see how gorgeous these are in real life they are absolutely beautiful so yep yeah, i am very excited for this project next up we have this now i think this is a keyring so i got the letter s um i thought my daughter like my daughter's absolutely obsessed with keyrings um so i just thought this would be a nice little project for either me to do for it or something she can do on her own um, it's double sided and as you can see really nice clear symbols i will put the screenshot up for you now just to have a look obviously you can get loads of different letters i think they're all on individual listings and um, they're not multiple choice on one listing but i said i will link this one down below um but you just need to search in the diamond painting accessories section and they will all come up so yep yeah, really nice well covered and um, it does have a clear cover on both sides and it is sticky underneath we get our toolkit, we get basic toolkit, but we do get a few baggies in this one as well. We get our where's my little chain gone? <laughs> so we do get the keychain, so you get the gold clip and then you get the beaded chain to attach. And just make sure that this works okay. And it does. Diamonds have got a nice selection of different ones on here. Um, we don't have any code or anything, we just have number. So we'll start over here. We get these beautiful little ones. These go gold side up. So the flat side is the clear side. So you get beautiful sort of little domed gold ones. We get these which go silver side up. I've not had these for, I don't think I've had these before. Beautiful little full on silver ones. They have got little facets on them. So they're going to be really sparkly. We get red rhinestones we have blue ab's beautiful so they're the round eight round drills with the blue um, iridescent coating on them really really pretty a few that have jumped into this one we've got green um crystals on there which are larger than the others we've got the same in the blue we have um sort of like these beautiful marquise ones which is purple pink red ab effect and then we have the larger gold pearls on there as well. And then we have a few specials. So we've got number nine, which is just this um, red, big red smooth crystal. Number eight, which is the smooth blue marquise. Number 10, which is the large blue one. And then number 11, which, oh, we've got these ones. Love these. Um, these are like AB clear so they shine different colors even though they are like a silver clear crystal but they've got these beautiful stars um, cut out of them so they're just a gorgeous gorgeous crystal really happy with that little project let's move on to this one so this is a diamond painting led light um there's nothing on it to indicate which one i ordered and i don't actually remember which one i ordered <laughs> Or should I say chose? I haven't actually ordered them. I just um, told them which ones I wanted and they sent them to me. So I've had these before um, and I just love them. So this is a little bit different, this one. Let's get everything off so we can have a look. Oh, it's the peacock one. Fabulous. So this is 
I'm going to take this off so you can see it, everything together. She says, when I can get it off. So, what you get first off is you get this sort of plastic base. So, this is in a light blue. It's plastic. It does have a little um, loop at the top so you can hang this one up. But it also has this, which means you can stand it as well. So, you can have it hanging or standing. This is where your batteries go. I think it's two double A's that go in here. And then we've got an on and off switch. Now, I believe this one comes with the lights already in. The ones I've had before, um, you do it and then you put little bulbs around. This is a little bit different. This has got the lights. Can you see already? You see inside there? That looks like the little lights already in there, I believe. We then get the actual sort of drill area. Um, this has got the clear cover, so you take the cover off. Put all your drills on. So it's this peacock. I'm going to put the screenshot up for you now. There's quite a few different ones to do on the site. They've got so many choice of products on their website. It's just unbelievable. And the prices are so good as well. And then when you're done with it, you attach it onto here. And then we also have this. So this is a beautiful sort of crocheted tassel that comes with it. It's in this gorgeous blue. Really, really pretty. Um, it's got this gorgeous sort of like little plastic bead in there. Um, and then we've got the other bit for the hanging up. So obviously if you want to hang it, um, I presume you attach this bit in there somehow. And then this one goes on the other side. So I'm, I'd have to figure out how they sort of fit into each other, if that makes sense. Um, toolkit, basic. And then the drills. So we've got, well, lots. Um, so on these bags, we do actually have codes on them. So this is our account, our project code. This is our symbol number. And then these are where your DMC numbers would normally be. Um, obviously, with the being crystals, these probably relate more to the company than the DMC chart. But we've got. A gorgeous gold, like a yellow gold um, limestone. We've got a deep blue. We've got a bright blue. We've got plain black, which is really good for detailing. We've got the clear crystal. We've got a couple of shades of sort of turquoise aqua colours. We then move on to the larger red ones and the blue ones. We've got the light blue, and then we've got the um, yellow gold in there as well. And then our special is these. Now look at those. I don't think I've had these before. So these are shining so many different like blues, purples, pinks, gold, even green hint to them. These are beautiful. Really pretty. You see the sort of just absolutely gorgeous really pretty drills and obviously those are going to go on the middle of the peacock feathers on here oh, i'm so excited for this that's going to be beautiful so yeah so that's our light um i really really like it i think it's really pretty really different again it's different to the lights i've had before excited for this one and my last sort of project with them is this and i do not know what this is cannot for the life of me remember what this is meant to be um so let's have a look oh it's a mirror <laughs> um i'll put the screenshot up now for you guys so this is a little compact mirror um i think they had a few different designs of this as well but this was the one i really liked um it's actually a lot bigger than i expected it to be So we get the mirror, the drills, and we get the basic toolkit. So the mirror is double-sided as well, which I really like. Um, it's got the clear cover and it's nice and sticky. Up close, you can see it's nice and clear. Looks like we go up to number six, so we should have six different crystals to go on here. And then it is just, is it a clasp opening? I don't think it's a clasp, I think it's, ma it's a magnetic opening. Not magnetic, it's a hinge opening, this one. And there you go, you can see my camera there. <laughs> um, so yeah. So it's double-sided compact mirror. 
two mirrors inside that's it's got a nice weight to it as well i really like this um it's one of those things that i've never actually got and yet it's one of those things i always need and i never think about it i'm always like i could do with a mirror and i never have one so i thought yep might as well get one and then our crystals we have up to number say number six so we've got one two three four five where's number five I think we're missing one right so if you look at this it looks like there's six colors but actually we've only got five we don't have a number two color that's why i was getting confused so actually these numbers are just a little bit out of sync so again it is something i need to let them know it might be that they've swapped over the symbols and the bags haven't quite caught up so it does say on here, look, it says one, two, three, and four. So number one is this white AB pill, which does match the number one on here. Number two is a really tiny little blue teardrop, which matches number three. Number three is the silver teardrop, which matches number four. And number four is the gold marquise, which matches number five. And then number six matches number six. So we're just a little bit out of sync with the first few. So there's actually only five crystals we need. So we actually have got them all. However, obviously it is an issue for someone who would get a little bit confused. So I will let them know about this. However, if I can figure it out, anybody can figure that out. Um, it just means that we've just got to make sure you're looking at which is which. Um, and I will probably just relabel these um one three four five rather than one two three four so yeah it's a great little project um and we do have everything we need so no need to worry canvas number one so this is our fifth item from this package they are so generous with the pr packages i'm really really grateful to them for this i don't remember what canvases i ordered by the way what have we got? Ooh, this is pretty. So this is our first canvas. As you can see, it's sort of like a mixed special drill, but it's sort of like a full drill at the same time. As you can see, it's this beautiful coloured tree. This is a 30 by 30 canvas. It's just really, really colourful. And I thought it was really pretty, a little bit different. Um, we have canvas code which is KA141 and then we just double check our drills mat. We have a legend on just one side on this one. But we have symbol number, symbol and DMC codes. Even though a lot of these will be crystals so it'll be sort of like their own DMC codes. They might not match your standard DMC charts. We've got a total of 21 colours which is fabulous and then up close as you can see this is super clear very very clear we've got a mix of sort of like large symbols and teeny tiny ones like number 16 number 21 and number four medium ones like number seven and then some big ones like number 18 and 19 and then number eight in the middle so i like these because there's such a range of sizes and i think it gives a really beautiful effect I just think they look really, really pretty when they're done. Basic toolkit with the black plastic tweezers in there. And then our drills. Let's start with these. So we've got white rounds, which look like 5200. We've got gorgeous sort of like turquoise green crystals. We've got some nice bigger ones. Are they the same? Yep, they're number three. So we've got two bags of these beautiful sort of sea blue large crystals. We've then got regular sized emerald green and larger sized, slightly darker colour. We've got sort of like some bronzy ones in the smaller size, medium in the dark blue, medium in the white and then small in the dark purple. Moving on to the larger ones in the dark purple, the big ones in the blue and the small ones in the blue. We've got basic black, 
We've then got small ones in the yellow gold and medium ones in the yellow gold. Small in the pink, medium in the pink. And then we move on to these, which are just absolutely stunning. These are sort of larger size ones and they're the gorgeous AB purple crystals. We've got the same in the red, which shine green and blue. And oh, just absolutely nice big bag of those. They are stunning. And then a bag of the red in the small. And then we do have a special one here for some reason separately. And these are just the medium in the red. So a really nice range of different colours, different sizes all round. So it gives a really nice effect. Very colourful. And the fact that we've got some ABs mixed in there as well. Really, really pretty canvas. And on to our last one for this package. Um, again, I don't remember what I ordered. <laughs> it was been a while. Let's see. Still don't remember. Oh, I do know which one this one is now. It is a glow-in-the-dark one. Now, I have got something similar from another company with this sort of night sky effect. I think it had the sunflowers on. I um, can't remember which company that was. It might have been from DP Clubs, but I, mm, I'll try and link it up there um, if I find it. Now, this is obviously the night sky one, this effect in the background, which you've probably seen in a lot of places. But this is actually sort of like over the sea, so we've got these beautiful waves. I just think it's really, really nice um it's a very nice image it's a 30 by 40 i'll put the screenshot up for you now so i'll show you the screenshot of it as it is completed and then the next screenshot i will show you is it's showing it lit up so this it's not the whole thing there's just certain parts of the picture that have the glow in the dark diamonds which obviously glow in the dark and i just thought it had a beautiful effect i've got quite a few of these now um I just like collecting them, I think. I've not actually done any of them. I'm just collecting them. <laughs> but I think they look fabulous and just excited for something a little bit different. When you've been doing that many and you've got so many, it's just nice to find things that have got a little bit of a difference to them. So I'm really happy with this one. Um, toolkit is basic, but we get a few baggies in there as well. And let's have a little look at this. So we've got our canvas code, which is YGSM. T46 and then we can check the bottom of the bags and it does match we have legend on both sides and we have a total of 20 colours and you can see we've got symbol number, symbol and DMC codes all the way down there and it looks like we've possibly got one AB which I didn't expect and we've got two glow in the dark colours which are number 14 and number 20 because they've got the YG on the end of the code that usually means they are glowing in the dark and up close i know this is going to be clear because i've seen their canvases before and yeah really nice we do have the training circles on them but um i think they're really good size they're not going to show up and they do help a lot of people and they keep the symbols really really clear to be honest so i think they're a good thing to be honest Really clear symbols, absolutely beautiful. So excited for this one. It's a nice canvas. It's got a little bit of crease at the top here, but it's, it is a little bit of a softer canvas. Um, obviously, it's a full round. It's a poured glue. Um, I think it's really nice. I think the glow in the dark is sort of like round the swirls and the edges of the waves, but you'll have seen it up on the screenshot already. And then final look at the drills and then we're done. So as you can see, we've got symbol number, DMC code and canvas code on there. So this is our glow in the dark. It's 5200YG. We've then got 3861 and 3860. But as you can see, we've had some of the blue jump in there. These are the two different brown shades. But I know I've got loads of these in my spare storage. So I might just swap them out for the ones I've already got. Um... 3846, beautiful turquoise colours with 3843. 3826, which is sort of like our tan colour. 996 YG, so that's our blue glow in the dark. Really, really pretty. I love that these can glow in the dark and you wouldn't look at them and think they do, but they do. And um, they definitely work. We've got 995, 977, 976, 
975. We've got 939, so a really, really dark blue. 979, 976. So we've got some lovely shading with these blues going on. 779, 747, 453, 452, 445, which is our bright yellow. And we have 444 in AB. So we actually have, can you see, they've got like this beautiful, it's not always obvious with the yellow in natural lighting, but they do have this sort of iridescent coating on them, which makes them extra sparkly. Can you see that? I just love the AB diamonds. Yeah, so overall, I think another amazing package from this company. Please go and check them out. Um, I had heard of them quite a bit before they contacted me and all I've seen is really, really good reviews from them. Um, great choice of products, as you can see. I will link the other video I did with them down below as well, as well as all of these products and to their website. Go and check them out and let me know what you think. Thank you to everybody at FG Normal for sending me another amazing PR package. I am honestly so grateful. Um, I love these products, I love the company, I love working with them. Absolutely, really, just love it. Um, and again, thank you to you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!